Hi, Todd Warren here in the Forecast Center with a look at our weather week ahead, including the update on the disturbance in the Gulf of Mexico, which will eventually become Tropical Storm Beta. As we uh, are looking at some drier air as of right now, which is making its way into the Arklatex, as we have seen a little bit more in terms of sunshine, still a touch of humidity. Uh, that will uh, eventually go down here as we work our way into uh, the weekend. Quick look at Robin's tour to Futurecast, showing you that, uh, again, we will see the quiet conditions across the region during the night tonight as we clear out. Again, that uh, somewhat breezy northeasterly wind will continue. For your Saturday, expect lots of sunshine, kind of a breezy day with northeast wind 10 to 15 miles per hour. We will stay clear for Saturday night. And then Sunday, we will start off with some sunshine, but clouds will be on the increase during the afternoon as that tropical system gets a little bit closer to us. In the meantime, temperatures will be pretty nice, looking at uh, lows across the region tonight that will range from the uh, low 60s north to the low to middle 60s south. 62 tonight in Texarkana, 64 in Shreveport, 64 degrees for the nighttime low tonight in Natchitoches. Daytime highs tomorrow should rebound back up into the 70s north to the low to middle 80 south. 84 in Shreveport, 83 in Natchitoches, 79 tomorrow in Texarkana, and 80 for the daytime high in Idabel. Again, these readings a few degrees below what is typical for uh, this time of year. Obviously, the bigger story later in the seven-day period will be uh, what is now, as I record this, Tropical Depression 22 likely will be upgraded some at some point this evening to Tropical Storm Beta. Maximum sustained winds now sitting at 35 miles per hour as the storm is moving towards the north-northeast at 7 miles per hour. It has uh, picked up some speed here recently. And here's the latest uh, forecast from the National Hurricane Center moving forward. And you can see that uh, as of 10 o'clock, we have a turn towards the west tomorrow. It could briefly become a hurricane this weekend and Sunday night. And then we'll see a turn towards the north and east as we head into Tuesday, as it looks like this system could hug the uh, coastline of Texas and eventually work its way towards and through uh, parts of Louisiana. Look at the uh, spaghetti models here. These are the forecast models showing uh, basically the uh, red line is the track from the National Hurricane Center. And you can see that uh, the models that go out farther do send it through parts of Louisiana. It looks like our biggest impacts would be Tuesday and Wednesday in terms of the rainfall here in the Arklatex. And as far as uh, how much rain we might see, one model's depiction, which does uh, tend to move this thing across southern Louisiana, uh, does show most of the Arklatex an inch or less, uh, but uh, we could see uh, totals that e eclipse five inches across the southern edge of the area. And keep in mind that this thing does move further to the north as I zoom out. You can see the red areas here. That's basically uh, totals of six to uh, seven inches of rainfall. So again, near and to the south and east of that track is where the heaviest rain will occur. Uh, so we'll have to keep an eye on what will be beta very, very closely moving through next week as there's a lot to be determined yet on the final uh, path that this storm could eventually take. So that being said, your seven-day forecast looks like this. We will see conditions across the Arklatex that will be pretty nice this weekend. In Shreveport, looking at low to middle 80s for daytime highs, I think we will see a little bit more in terms of clouds late in the day Sunday. Uh, we'll see a, a mostly cloudy sky Monday, a few scattered showers possible. With clouds and rain Tuesday and Wednesday, we will struggle to make it to 70 for a daytime high, believe it or not. Lows will be in the mid-60s, and then we'll dry out as we head into the last half of next week as temperatures should return to the middle 80s by next weekend. So all in all, a uh, weekend looking pretty nice, followed by the arrival of what uh, will eventually be Tropical Storm Beta as it could move just to the south of the Arklatex by the middle part of next week.